Kidnapping's new second in charge has spoken openly with Win News about his promotion and what he hopes to achieve. The Deputy Chief Police Officer revealed one focus is making sure the community gets the service it deserves. Meeting the troops and settling in to a new office. The first day in a high profile job, the seventh commander to fill the position. Normal apprehension moving into a new role, but I'm really excited. I, I'm really proud of being a police officer. I'm really proud of wearing the uniform and I'm, um, I'm thankful for giving the opportunity to, to serve for ACD policing and I think that's a great honour being the nation's capital. David Price has been working with the AFP in Canberra for two years. He moved from the Northern Territory, where he served as a police officer for two decades, joining the force at the age of 17, straight out of school. There's been some occasions that I, uh, I'm thankful that I'm still alive, and there's other occasions where I, um, I'm, I was so glad that I was a police officer, where I've brought conclusion to a crime or um, helped a victim or just been there when times were tough. David Price has spent the past few weeks familiarising himself with the nitty gritty of ACT policing, heading out on patrol, scoping out the city after dark. ACT policing have done very well over the last 12 months, so I guess my initial uh, challenge is to maintain that performance. The Deputy CPO wants to make sure the community feels like it's getting value for money, that the service provided meets Canberra's expectations. On a personal level, he's looking forward to working in a force not bound by state or territory lines. You have the world spotlight on you when it comes to national affairs. We've got Parliament here and we've had recent visits from the President of the United States of America. We've had the um, visit by Her Majesty the Queen. So all of a sudden ACT policing is on a world stage. Gemma Coombe, Win News.